Alright guys, this is Tolsey here, welcome back to another BOTB related video. This one is on the new dream car picture, just my first look at the picture, just to show you guys what the picture looks like. And I may also um, import it into Photoshop and put the target on the picture, try and get a more accurate first impression. Um, on Saturday night, late night, I did a live stream. Um, I tried to kind of mention it in Cam's chat like 20 minutes before he went live, just to, you know... Um, mention it to him really like i was planning on streaming maybe but i understood that he said it maybe earlier in the week that he was streaming and i think it got a bit misconstrued and he thought i was like promoting in his channel which um he said oh you know um if you want to do that that's fine but um ask me first kind of thing but don't just do it like without asking me um, because then people are like asking, oh, are you going live, blah, 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 in his chat, which I can understand, but I went on a long-winded um, kind of listing several points about how I feel on that matter in this live stream. Um, I may do a video on all of that, or it's maybe best just to leave a lot of it just in, you know, unsaid and in the past, because, yeah, it's just a whole can of worms, all that. But my main point was that he was saying, oh, you need to, you know, you need to ask before saying that kind of thing. I can understand that, but we are a very small community of YouTubers. There's like maybe four or five of us. And um, for that reason, like, it's not like I'm a brand new viewer to his channel and I've just started making BOTB videos. I was there two years ago um, and I've only just come back in the last couple of months, I guess. But yeah, um, <laughs> I don't want to say I don't want to seem wrong, but in a sense, I feel like we shouldn't need to ask. You know, I mentioned the Gujarati guys in every video, and they even had a go at me um, a couple of days ago, saying, "Oh, you know, you you never you never forget to mention your channel in your comments every time." And I'm like, that's because you know, if if they watched my videos, they would know where what my impressions on the picture are, what coordinate they can put on their Excel sheet in in advance, and. Um, yeah, just other techniques that I show. I, I don't know. Anyway, I'm sure I had more points, but I'm I'm a bit tired. Well, I'm not even tired because I've been getting up late. Um, I'm trying to fix my sleep pattern because I've been waking up at like 6 or 7 at the minute and uh, currently work in the evenings, like late nights, but uh may change it to daylight hours because I don't think it's doing my head any good. Um, it's around this time of the year. It's just, I don't know, I just get into arguing with people it seems so yeah sorry about the long intro i'll just quickly show you the live stream for whatever reason um i tried to edit it so that there's like a little blur section at the beginning um it won't let me like i wanted to like cut out sets you know little bits where i was watching youtube videos for ages um like stuff like that or specking out specking up cars which wasn't really useful but um here's what i kind of Here's what our kind of cluster look like. Um, I also had a spreadsheet, as you can see here. I copied all the points from Cam's stream. I'm sure this isn't a bad thing to do. Um, you know, I'm not naughty for doing this. I'm basically just saying as if the people were in my stream <laughs> and uh, using those points, copying his cluster, because I have got close doing this myself, but then drawing my own lines. Nothing wrong with doing that. Um, and then took some pen and paper points before I actually put these on the website. I did this before I went live, um, you know, did my coin trick, uh, printed out several versions of the picture with different targets on. Again, I showed this on the live stream and um, yeah, came up with a few different coordinates. I also put in Cam's new average just before I played my tickets just to see where that was. But I mostly played in this area. Um, I'll show you my exact tickets in a second, but yeah, Black Friday code BF15 was actually pretty good because it took 15% off what it would have cost me for the um, credit as well, which I didn't realise. So the actual discount on how much um, I was going to have to pay for the week out of my own pocket was a lot more than 15% because the credit went a lot further, if that makes sense. Anyway. Rambling over, it's just a bit annoying that basically I can watch in HD here because this is the first version. But on YouTube, it only says SD, so I tried to add a little blur, and then I was either going to remove the blur and then trim it, or just keep the blur there and then trim it. Um, 
and for whatever reason it's saying it's still not processed so the bit the full vods here at the minute and i'm not sure about that so um there may be a few sections where i might like um accidentally showed some like personal information which i don't really want on my youtube i mean people could figure it out and i'm not exactly you know taking the best precautions doing live streams and everything but yeah um i'd rather make sure i'm not like giving out anything too mad um yeah one thing i did mention though was a uh, vibav i coincidentally found him uh his twitter page because he posted this thing about sidemen sides like their food thing and uh yeah it blew up got 7k likes and stuff and yeah vibav has his own youtube channel this is vibav from botb for gujarati so check out his channel if you like he does like tech based videos again i don't care to give people shout outs i'm not you know, I don't understand why some people are really like protective over following, likes, you know, trying to help one another. I personally, well, it's just a big online community. You jump, you run into the same people so many times. It's pointless trying to just be a bit gatekeepy about things, I think, anyway. Um, but again, I, I went into a load of stuff about my personal experiences with people, you know, self promotion perhaps, or, um, like there was a Pokemon Go group type thing um, near me, and I said, "Look, guys, you should, uh, you know, just with WhatsApp groups, uh, when you join them, you can't see the previous messages, and like it becomes a bit unorganized as well, trying to find previous stuff. Discord servers are so much better. So I joined this community for like Pokemon Go, and was like, oh, um, you know, you guys should should move to a Discord server. I'll set it up and everything. All you guys have to do is join it." And they were like, oh, no, this works well for us and blah, blah, blah. And then when the chat was popping because I'd, I'd been arguing a little bit about this or whatever, but I, I was going to accept it, whatever they wanted, I guess. Not much I could have done, but it, they ultimately got pissed off with me and kicked me out. So some of them actually blocked my phone number, so whatever. And also now they know my phone number, which is a, a little bit scary, I guess, because as I mentioned in the live stream as well, I think if you guys use... Um, Google Authenticate, you know, use Google Authenticator apps and things like that rather than your phone number to secure your accounts because uh, people can copy your phone number. So just be careful with giving out your phone number, guys, or, you know, things like that because you never know. Um, Right, anyway, I've not even got to the picture. I'm really sorry for all the rambling. It's just... um. Uh, like I say, a few things that needed to get out of the way. I may leave a little bit of text at the start of the, uh, the, start of the video um, for people who aren't bothered about all of this, but it is things which are on my mind and, yeah, my channel. So, yeah, these are the points I kind of played. I played two random GTR points here at 1999-1096 because this was near the Gujarati and the cam's latest average on the X and 2001-1098. Uh, Tried to go near 1998 or 1999 because these are like the kind of years I was born and yeah, these kind of coordinates I thought, you know, then they might turn up and if they do, I'd win a GTR plus 50k, so hopefully they'll still get zone 1 or zone 2. I'm not throwing my money away, but uh, my main cluster where I played for the Mac 1, I did have them down for the A45S, but ultimately I think the Mac 1 is a car I'd actually keep if I won it. But then again, I'm not sure because it's a Mustang and they are quite commonly stolen. I was just thinking with an A45, it's like a 50 grand hot hatch. And it's not really feasible to keep that. Plus, I feel like I've given a bit of a sour impression to people so I might come around and damage it. I'd be a bit pissed off with that. I don't know. Anyway, maybe I'm just overthinking things. But um, here are my points. You can see if I scroll down. I mainly played around the 20, 30, 20, 40 range on the X and 1090 to 1000 on the Y. After doing a lot of uh, you know analysis, that's what I got. This was my free ticket 2140, 1216, which um, I think it was this one down here. I actually thought this was my, um, I thought I played a ticket like around 2140, 
1141 or something, which was a point that I did get from doing line tricks and things before. But um, yeah, the line tricks all had the thing around here, 2140. 2140 or 2150 on the X, so we'll see what the X coin that does. But yeah, pen and paper, coin, and everything got me about 2030, 2040, so we'll see. Um, some of the YouTube channels went a bit more left, which I don't know, I couldn't see it being that far left to the edge of the building, so yeah. Sorry, guys, again, uh, I feel like I'm just rambling. Sorry, I'm not going straight to the picture. Um, so I'm assuming I'm going to have to play my free ticket. It is interesting that they've put this Liberty Walk Super in. Not something I would have expected, to be honest. But, um, yeah, you can see all the things you get. I don't know who, who's actually, um, building it. You know, if you actually do win it, because that's kind of crazy, but I feel like people just take cash alternative on this. I feel like Bentley Bentayga has changed colour. It was red before, now it's blue. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, so here's the new picture. <sighs> what do you think? Um, let's just add a couple more tickets. Up. Right. I'm just going to use the website here quickly. So... Okay, so first guess there, 1773, 783. Um, that might be a bit too high. I'm not sure if that if that's too like not angled enough, or maybe it'd be a, be a bit more left. I don't know. But yeah, it's a bit of a ambiguous picture. It maybe want to skip to be honest. Um, yeah, I could pull the target up and do the photoshop but I may leave that for this video because I have gone on for ages but um yeah I'd probably be looking somewhere around this area this kind of ball area looks okay um yeah I don't know if there's anything more to say sorry guys <laughs> but yeah could could do the target thing, but I need to look at what the similar pictures to this look like as well. And then we can get a better idea of where to put the target. So let me know if that's okay. Um, I'll look at the midweek as well, I guess. So um, personally, if I was playing the midweek, I'd probably play for this. Because my sister has always said, oh, she wants a Mini Cooper. And the golf club sports a bit of me, I guess. So we could have a car each if we won that. Um, but... Uh, I also like the A45S, but then I don't know why, what the purpose of the up is. Unless you had like a, you know, grandparent or a parent who wouldn't mind using this for their shopping. Um, I don't really see the point. So I've already just watched the Gujarati video. Mostly for the uh, midweek. I can't remember what their point was though. But so I'll just give you mine. Rough look. That's it. It's steeper. Yeah. And then do the ear and mouth.
Yeah, that looks okay. To the air mouth on this guy as well, sorry. Like that, I suppose. So seventeen eighty four seven six seven. Let me just pull up their spreadsheet. They've gone eighteen ninety nine six three. So um let me see where that goes. About there. I don't know if my guesses are really off right now, guys. Uh, hold up. Maybe it's in between. <laughs> in between both of ours. That eye, I don't feel like he's looking that low. So perhaps an adjusted coordinate would be um, uh, 1858885. I think the Gujarati guys were actually planning on going 80 pixels lower than um, their ultimate, which actually maybe they need to go 80 pixels higher than their average. Um, so yeah, that's probably my take on it. Um, yeah, I think this may have been a bit too high. Sorry about that. You never know though, a judge might put it there and then the average may land here. It does encaps encapsulate in the uh, magnifier, so they could keep that in as a point, so sorry about that. Difficult to say. Um, doesn't look like either of them is going to hit the ball like, super soon, so yeah, I'd say that middle point is good. Bottom points, the Gujarati ultimate average. They even placed one, I think, tw you know, like 1024. Um, I think they had this one on their video as well. But um, personally, I think it might be 10, uh, 80 pixels higher, not lower. So, yeah, they kept saying they were getting 80 pixels off with the height. So, <laughs> but their X coordinate's pretty good. So, it's pretty close to mine X coordinate, I guess, there. Not the first one, though. But yeah, I hope that helps. Um, Maybe I'll do a bit more of a detailed look, but I'm just trying to get this video up because I'm really sorry about the live stream. It's not um, it's not processing, and I don't want to upload it in its full entirety because it is a five hour um, live stream, five hours forty one minutes at the moment, and um, I'd say probably two or three hours of it is just me watching YouTube videos or just chilling with. Uh, Esmond and uh, Mr. Ravage C who were in the chat. So thanks a lot again to them two guys. And also Lindman, I think, was there towards the end. Uh, OMG It's Rex, I think, was there towards the end. And there was also a newer guy called Dennis, I think it was, who also um, turned up. So thanks a lot to all those guys for tuning into the live stream. Uh, I did say if, if they liked the live stream, 
Um, I may leave it unlisted so that they could check the coordinates, but I wasn't comfortable with uh, keeping whatever, you know, was there uh, just so anyone with the link could see it in case um, someone who wants to get me in trouble with Cam or whatever for saying something uh, goes and shares it with him. I mean, like I said, I've tried to repeat some of the points, but um, another point I made was like, basically, I I started doing these videos because Cam was stopping playing and he he was becoming a bit like, um, you know, one video a week, two videos a week. Now he's doing one video nearly every day um, for the last couple of days. Uh, I don't know if it's just because it's getting to Christmas. He thinks more people are going to be playing, so they want he wants to maximize his chances of his channel doing well, or if he's seeing me as competition or the Gujarati people as the competition and they're trying and he's trying to like just wipe us out i don't know um he did say did make a comment which quite kind of annoyed me that he was like oh uh not annoyed me but you know he said um if you want to live stream at the exact same time as me that's fine but i know people are going to go check my coordinates that's what he said um so basically he's saying live stream at the same time as me but i know you no one's going to watch it and obviously I want people to watch my content, so I'm not going to post at the same time as him. I want to make sure there's BOTB videos, BOTB content at all times. So when he's not posting, I can post and try and fit around each other. You know, I want all the YouTubers to collaborate, you know, grow together. Not this like, I don't know if it's just because when money's involved with monetization and, you know, like with Twitch and stuff as well. Um things turn a bit sour you know he's trying to do this patreon he even said it at the end of the live stream again that um i think he said it in today's one as well which i haven't really watched that much that he's going to do patreon only live streams again but um he is going to do them still for free on the normal youtube times so i don't know I just feel like the Patreon thing, I, I get it, but at the same time, I want people to win without paying for the Patreon. And hopefully, people understand the amount of time that I spend just outside of these videos looking at these pictures and stuff. Right? I'm trying to give you guys the best coordinates, pretty much. Um, I'm sorry, my first impression ones are pretty bad. Even these ones in this video might not be great, but um, it's not my job. <laughs> I, I'm I'm not paid to do BOTB things. Maybe that's what he's trying to do. But um he he actually joked about the people who spend seven days looking at the picture because the funny thing is people go and look at his average, play around his average and win, and that's that's it. So I don't know how to feel about that either. I'm trying to give you guys the tools to, to win and what I'm doing, so it kind of might shoot me in the foot. But um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to go on for too long. I could go on, on about it forever. I did in this bloody live stream, but um, I may um, still post this. What if the processing works and I can cut it like just the bits where I'm watching videos or whatever, which aren't helpful to the BOTV part. Um, maybe keep a little bit where I'm talking to you know, Desmond about various different instant noodles and things. I found out that the um, the Nissin Sober Noodles Yakitori. These noodles are what I love at the minute. Food Review UK did a review of them. Might have to watch that. But um, yeah, these are beautiful. Love them. But um, turns out Nissin uh, noodles they're also the same brand that do the dame ramen which syndicate i think likes in this chicken flavor i didn't realize that and uh, desmond recommended a desmond recommended a uh another type of instant noodle but again for whatever reason like when i searched with google or you know various things even here when i'm typing in my address bar you might see various personal things which other YouTubers aren't going to do, they just stick on the BOTB, BOTB website, but I'm a bit more casual. Anyway, this video has gone on for way too long, I'm not sure if anyone's actually watched it all the way through, but I just wanted to get those things 
off my head. Um, here's the midweek picture. And for the dream car, we will um, spend some more time looking at it. So this won't be the only time I look at the dream car, probably, um, unless I've won. And in that case, I can't look at the picture. So I hope you guys understand. But um, if you guys, you know, show it on YouTube, I might be able to help, you know, what the picture looks like. But I have tried to give a little look at it here. So you guys won't be completely screwed. And yeah, um, I don't know what else to say. I don't even know if I'm making sense anymore. <laughs> I really do wonder. But um, yeah, a good stream. Um, you know, anything here that's... Yeah, so you're taking the target, for example. Um, doing all sorts of tricks. And like, this is the layout I had on my printouts. You know, I put the coordinates in white and stuff and then drag the target and yeah um kind of annoying that i couldn't get this live stream up for you guys before whatever but also i i do want the people who were there live to um you know have that information and maybe not just have someone who turns up like right at the end uh, you know before just 10 minutes before the competition closes and watches my video and then wins um like you know other channels might have that happen but at the same time not everyone's going to be around at, like from tw uh, you know midnight till 5 a.m so yeah i did i did want to get this live stream up in some format but five hours was probably too much so i wanted to be able to cut it down and i can't at the minute so I don't know if there's any point actually keeping the stream up. And like I say, I said some things about, you know, the cam thing and the Patreon and, uh, you know, the Gujarati guys saying all the best. Uh, sometimes it's like, well, they're saying all the best when they don't even agree. Like, it's like, I, I agree to disagree. All the best. Good luck with that, mate. You know, like, <laughs> it always makes me laugh. But, um, yeah. I, I, I don't mean to be rude to anyone, right? And I feel like I was made out to be a bit of a bad guy on cam stream, so I didn't say anything today. Um, I also didn't watch until like 10 minutes from the end, so it was kind of pointless for me to say hi in this chat. Um, yeah. Plus, there seemed to be people from his community who chased down to my stream and said, oh, you, you, you know, again, like the Gujarati, oh, you, you mentioned your stream or your channel in every every single stream of his and so fine i just won't comment so yeah honestly i feel bad because if i do win you know i'm just gonna have this lingering over me so i'm just posting this video to kind of clear the air on some of that but maybe this will make it worse i don't know i'm terrible with social things aren't i but uh, yeah, not the most upbeat video, but I hope you've, I've given you guys a little bit of insight on the uh, new newer pictures, the dream car, the midweek ones, and you know, you'll hopefully at least get zone three if you play there, um, maybe better. It depends, like the zones are quite deceiving, unless you actually put the target on the picture, like you have like a hundred by a hundred area or maybe like 200 by 200 so it's not that small to get zone 2 or zone 1 but um yeah don't know if um my mum's going to sleep or something so I'm worrying like I'm just rambling on for the last half an hour and you know it's going to come in at any point I don't know <laughs> anyway I am done here I will um stop recording this and uh get it rendered put it on my youtube and yeah sorry guys if this wasn't the most upbeat video but um yeah I, I don't know what to say people say don't don't let the don't let the haters get too much but at the same time i i can't really change how i am to some to some respect and it's like the same things happen again and again i'm sorry about that but, uh, yeah. Um, 
yeah, we'll see how the dream car result goes and um, take it from there because it's always a learning process with trying to figure out how to win. But uh, yeah, I've got a lot of credit probably invested now and hopefully it will happen at some point. I wish all the best and luck to Chutney, um, Juice, uh, you know, Asama or MD Hakim and all these people who seem to constantly get close. Desmond also might might win if he plays around my area and our area is right. So yeah, pretty confident in our area, even though it doesn't look anything like where I think it should be. It could go more more to the right. You never know. Um, but we'll learn. We'll learn and we'll keep going, guys. So yeah, I'm probably gonna have to listen to this video again and just make sure I'm actually making any sense, or I'll just post it up. I don't know. Um, but yeah, guys, I um, also meant to say, like, ha check out the crypto markets are doing just for historical context. You know, check this video back in like a few years time. Obviously, the live stream is not going to go up. So um, at this rate, crypto has actually suddenly really just gone off in the last couple of hours. Like the dip that we had in the 25th has just suddenly rallied up. That's really wild. I um, have to see what the uh, subreddits are saying about this. Um, do expect Litecoin here if it's not even taken off. Like this, this Litecoin will be at two hundred and twenty probably in the next like two days. I, I bet, I bet it because Bitcoin's already taken off, so Litecoin's being a bit slow to catch up. Um. That might be something I need to do myself. <laughs> anyway, um, not financial advice. I'm just keeping an eye on how this goes because I'm kicking myself for not um, watching Bitcoin back here. And like I say, this area in 2019, the 2018 to 2019, and this area here, when it was nearly at its lowest, I should have been keeping my eye on the ball. But hindsight is a beach, so. I'm done guys, <laughs> can't believe I made this into such a long video, um, you know, you can share your points in the comments below, but for some reason YouTube keeps um, blocking people, putting loads of numbers in the comments, I think because of these like telephone number, WhatsApp scams and things going on, so uh, yeah, I could make it so all comments are uh, allowed, I might do that, so let us know where you went on this week's dream car picture. If you're still watching at this point, I do ramble on. Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So yeah, it's been James and Stolzy. I'm out. Peace.